Howdy y'all, I'm Round the Wheel, you're watching the Neolimix Introduction Pack. Uh, last time we got fully certified on skills, and this time we are dipping our toe into the objects and functions. Those parts of the level that Lemmings can interact with, but which are generally not assignable. And this one is called Index Error, Out of Bounds. All sides of a level are deadly. Top, bottom, left, and right. Any lemming that tries to cross them dies immediately. So try to keep them away from the edges at all cost. Yeah, in some versions of lemmings, uh, when they hit the edge, they'll turn back around. I think that was the case in Lim Mini, if I recall correctly. Um, but in this Neo Limix, you cannot let them go off any side of the screen, which is open. So they're going to go off, off the top here. We're gonna have to block them off. So same here for the left side. Looks like there's hazards on all sides. So we're gonna be going, let's see, all right. And then yes, we must keep them from going off the pit to the side here and then off to the right at the end of the level. Looks like this is gonna take about five blockers and we have six. So we do have spare, spare assignments here. So let's go ahead and Let's just go ahead and wait for him to get into position. No fancy dancy fast forwarding today. Let's just let him get to the where they're going and then right into the dip ought to be fine. And let's see. All right. Nope, that's a little bit too. Let's see. Let's let's go back until it only takes one builder. I think one more frame is perfect. Yes. There we go. All right. Very nice. And then he'll go up off the top again, so a blocker right in this neighborhood ought to do it. I keep wanting to press the P key to pause because I've been playing Lemmings to the Tribes, but spacebar is my pause key. I'm either going to have to change the hotkey or become accustomed to it. One or the I'm probably just going to get used to it. I'm a, I'm a lazy pants that way, so let's go ahead and bop you way forward. There we go. And this should be the last of it. I think everybody is out at this point. I could have messed with release rate, but that didn't really seem like a necessary thing to do. So let's just get them all into the... There we go. And then nuke to free the rest of their obligations. It's a sad way to do it, but it must be done, unfortunately. I know. I feel as bad about it as you do. So, moving on to the next level. We only needed 20, but we did 25. I guess we could have let some lemmings walk off the screen if we were if we were kind of a butterfingers in that way, but no, not not happening so much. Iron Ant Hill. This is objects and functions level 4, 30 lemmings. Got to save all but 4 of them. It looks like we're going to be learning about steel in this one. There can be more than one hatch or exit. Well, I didn't see that part. Pause and look around the start to catch them all. Levels can vary in height, so you may also have to scroll up and down instead of just left and right. That's right, Neolimix has vertical scrolling, just like Limix 2 the Tribes did. Steel can't be damaged by destructive skills. It's usually easy to recognize, but if you're having trouble, press forward slash for clear physics mode. So you can kind of see where your triggers are. Uh, or press the pink and gray button on the right. It lets you see clearly what is terrain and what is steel, and also which objects are present, where their trigger areas are. That is something we use to great effect a couple of times in Lemmings Redux, as I recall correctly, more on clear physics mode in later levels. Now try to dig through this steel maze. Oh, ho, ho, ho. let's see. So we're going to have to look very carefully around, and it looks like we might be... Okay, how we got lots of hatches here, but we have lots of digging skills as well, so should be able to make it out of here. And I think, yeah, the steel for the most part is going to be uh, not diggable. So let's we've got infinite time. The timer counts up, so let's do one bit at a time. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and get them fencing up the way here. That's probably fine. And then they can bash to the end. Okay, so we can work with. We can just kind of move around. It looks like, doesn't look like any traps are going to be a problem here. This might be one of the more awkward ones right here. I can see a lot of digging is going to be required to get that one going. So let's go from kind of least difficult to most. Uh, this one is going to be pretty easy. And it's only going to take one basher. I thought it would take two. Very nice. So a lot of bashing going to be happening here. So, I already hear 
I already hear woohoos and yippies. That's good. All right, so let's go ahead and oh, that's gonna hit steel. Uh, but we've got plenty of we got plenty of freebies. It's okay. I don't have to be too precise. I don't think. Uh, seems to be a lot of leeway here in this one. This is gonna be a. Ah, I heard the hit of the of the miner down here. Yep, that was just a bit of unfortunate business. But let's see if we can't get maybe a dig going here. Very nice. Okay, we salvaged it pretty well, I would say. So we've got this going now. So now we have to work on these. Let's go ahead and dig straight down through here. Think if we go ahead and... All right, go ahead and uh, press three, I think was my... Yeah. All right, I think we can bash through here till steel hits. There we go. All right, and then down to the right. Yep, we're just going to be making a ziggy zaggy tunnel. Let's go ahead and start working them at the same time. This is going to get... This is where I'm going to stop pausing and focusing on individuals. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, there we go. All right, so as he goes down... All right, I'm going to want my miner to go... There we go. Start bashing. Start bashing, sir. Basher ahoy. There we go. All right, this is working out really well for us. And now you are going to want to dig. Okay. I'm going to have him fence at a point. I think I can get him going some kind of way. We will make it through this anthill yet. I promise. I swear it on my life. There we go. By my, by my own skills as a limbing savior, we can do this. This shouldn't be too tough. There we go. And uh, how about a how about a miner right here? Did he, I didn't see the tunnel. Did, was he going to hit steel? Looks like he might have. Let's go ahead and dig just to, just to mitigate it. I wonder what the minimums for getting out of here are. That would be, that would be an interesting little experiment. But looks like we've done it. They're all converging toward that middle one. I don't think there's anything hidden that we have to worry about. I think we are good as gold. There we go. All right. We saved every single lemming. There was no way to get any lemmings killed, really. So the 26 is kind of an kind of an odd benchmarker. I don't, I don't really know about that. What's coming up next? Trap roulette. Okay. This is... Okay. This is one feature I think is pretty recent to Neo Limix, which is that you can combine tile sets... Used to be you couldn't do that, but now you can just combine them. And I see some Lemmings 2 Space Steel in here. Uh, some custom tile sets that uh, Lemmings Forums users have made. Uh, this Honeycomb, this Beehive one right here, I think that's a Namita creation. Got your regular dirt tile set here and some others. Just some, uh, just some good old times. So let's continue. This is about traps, not about who decorated what parts of the level. Some traps only go off once. After the activation, they are completely harmless. Let's see if you can avoid the normal endless traps and find the route with the single-use traps. Clear physics mode will help you here. Hovering the mouse over an object tells you exactly what it is when the mode is active. It also helps in detecting somewhat hidden objects by displaying them and their trigger in a brash color. A nice, bold fuchsia magenta. One-way fields turn around lemmings in the indicated direction when they walk into it. That also includes the skills the lemmings currently perform. Okay. So, as opposed to like... Okay, let's see what we got here. Where's this one-way field that, that he is speaking of? I'm not really seeing it right now. Let's see what clear physics mode gets us. Okay, we've got some traps here. This is one trap, one trap, one trap, one trap. Infinity trap. Okay, so yeah... So there's the idea. All right, let's see. Oh, we got the uh, the Amiga Oh No More Limits music going here. That's cute. An infinity trap, fire, fire, exit. All right, so we can go through here and see what... Okay, this is going to be... Yeah, I was going to say, this is an infinity trap. It's a pretty nasty one, as I recall. Uh, ten bashers, one miner. So we're probably... I'm going to guess... Okay, how many... We got to save 40... Lemmings out of 50 and we got to do it how do we only have one hatch we do good okay all right so did this say this was a trap this is the airlock from Lemmings 2 right it's an infinity trap yes and we see the little beehive thing going on here okay I think I've got it pretty well in hand oh no destructo trap oh that's rough Ooh. okay so this one's gonna go off 
That's three. Oh, gosh. Oh, he just got my girl. That's... Uh, oh, I did this all wrong. Oh, yeah, we don't want him falling into there. No way. Let's see that again. <laughs> that was a... Uh, that was kind of disturbing, actually. <laughs> oh, oh, loomings are allergic to bee stings, it would seem. Okay, let's actually not do that this time. Let's let him go a little higher up. There we go. Avoid the airlock altogether. Very nice. Okay. So, we're going to see another lemming get Macaulay Culkin here. Alright, and we're going to go... Okay, yes. Oh, there, there it was. There it happened. I, I just kind of got away from it a little. Okay, so, here we go. I'm going to go in here. I think he's... They're going to... I think they're going to walk up through this. That's kind of a little Venus lemming trap there. I see that. Okay, so... Now, what should happen? I see this one-way field over here. That's going to divert us to the other side. So that's where we're going to use our miner. Very good. Okay, so... I think they'll walk up... Yeah, they do. Okay. Very good. And then something will happen so that they turn around. Yeah, so we're going to need this one to bash through here so that they don't go up into the infinity trap. All right, very good. I have a feeling these swords are not going to play very nice with us. No, they are not. Okay. So... Alright, this is an infinity trap down here, so we need to go ahead and go up through here. There's a trap right here, very deadly. So that's four, five, six, seven. And then, yeah, I think just seven lemmings are going to die here, probably. Seems like the number we're aiming for here. Alright, very nice. I think we've got this one. I think we've got this one. Well, that's pretty cool with the... There are traps that work an infinite amount of times, and then there are traps that work only one time. I like how they differentiate between them. And that's very clever for a puzzle. Ooh, gory. Nice sound effect, though. So, okay, so we're going to bash through here now. We're going to bash through this lovely bouquet of flowers. What's going to happen here now? How gruesome is this one going to get? Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Okay, so maybe two livings. So maybe that's eight that we're going... No, we've got 40. 40 and 40. Okay, so that should be good. We should be good to the end. All right, so let's go ahead and fast forward it now that we know that everybody is secure. Some lemmings died so that others could live. Some lemmings walked so that others could run. 40, 40, 40. Right on. Can't get much closer than that. Okay, so next up, we're making it pretty well through the objects here. Follow the arrow. So this is one-way walls, and traditionally, one-way walls have been either left or right, but in Neolimics, you can also go up or down with them. 40 lemmings, gotta save 30. We've got two hatches here, so lead on, my friends. One-way walls, O-W-W, -W, or OW for short, can only be destroyed in the direction the arrows are facing. Left and right facing OWWs need to be destroyed by left and right facing bashers, fencers, or miners. Diggers and bombers also work. Downwards facing OWWs need to be destroyed by diggers, miners, or bombers. Fencers and bashers do not work at all. Upwards facing OWWs need to be destroyed by fencers or bombers. Bashers, miners, and diggers do nothing. Use the climbers in this level to get to the right positions to tear down the owls. Okay, so here we go. No time limit here either. I'm very thankful for that. So let's see. Let's we, we gotta get the climbers into position. All right. I think we can probably do with one climber to explore. All right. Let's go ahead and do it up like that. We're gonna go ahead and save the rest by. Okay. We're just gonna let him kind of explore for a minute, get turning around and going every which way. And we're going to mine down through here. Probably could have bashed through here, but that's okay. It's not entirely necessary. All right, so we're going to be fencing through here. I don't think we're going to need to... Yeah, we are going to need to kill some lemmings, actually, because I see the upward... I see the upward-facing arrow there. So, yes, unfortunately, we must sacrifice a few. So we should probably get... Uh, it looks like one, two, maybe three climbers are going to take some heat there. So let's go ahead and get a couple more going. All right, very good. All right. Maybe, let's see. 
how do we want to handle this right here? We want to mine through here, clearly. Uh, but how do we want to get a long little doggy here? Okay, let's go ahead and bash for that. I think his friend will catch up. Yeah, there we go. Very nice. Okay. We'll go ahead and let him turn around and be the path maker. Then we will... Then we'll blow up the other two. We'll see if two or three... It looks like three craters high. I could be wrong about that. And if I am, it's okay. I think we got, we've got quite a lot of leeway on this level. So let's go ahead and get... When can we start mining? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Now we should be able to. Oh, wow. Okay. In fact, he should probably go a couple more frames forward. There we go. Very nice. Frame exactitude. Gotta love it. So let's go ahead and... What's gonna happen here? Okay, that's... One... Yeah, I think two might make it. I think I may have overestimated that. But that's... Or, you know, I may not even have to kill him at all. Okay, yeah. We're good. We're good on all that front now. So let's go ahead and get... Oh, can I not bash through that? Can I not bash through the downward moving one? I thought I could. But I just... Did I just get him on a weird... Yeah, I just got him on a weird hang. Well, that's gonna... That's gonna be a little unfortunate. Well, hmm. Yeah, I think that was explained to me, so that's my fault for missing out on that. Oh no, what are you doing? Why are you turning around, sir? I don't think so. Your job here is not done. We still need... Oh, this is turning out actually kind of disastrously for me. So I think... Well, we've got three more bombers. We could conceivably do it. Let's go ahead and... Uh, to... Okay, good. It all worked out in the end. But now... Now everything is all situated. And I did not allow leeway to... I did not... Okay, he, the, the unfortunate part is that he turned around after he finished mining. I didn't want that. Uh, now there's really no way to get them... Well, that's not entirely true. I think this could... Yeah... We could save this. There may be a way to save this. Let's see if it works out. Okay, so you get going. Alright, so I may be able to turn him around and still make this viable. I can't believe this. I can't... I can't... I really made a hash of this one, but... There we go. Perfect. Okay, that's absolutely... Wow, I do not deserve to have succeeded at this level, and yet... Fate has seen fit to allow me to get away with it anyway. I can't believe it. I really, I really tore this one. Really made a mess of this one. And yet somehow, somehow the contents within were still salvaged. Some people have said that I give up too easily on certain levels. And maybe that's true. So whoever has said that before, this one is for you. Uh, there, have, there have been a few people who have been like, yeah, you know, you, you didn't have to start over there. But it's just something that makes me more comfortable to do. It makes me more comfortable to start over when I feel like all is lost. But in this case, nice to see that it was uh, reworkable. Now, this could be a little bit of a bad step here, actually. I hope they can walk over that. But it's possible that they might not be able to. Okay, good. Whew! I, I was fully prepared to be like, see, I was right, you were wrong. I should always start over when I feel like it. Nah. So, Climber is bringing up the rear. I think that's going to save everybody. And I'm, we're going to call that an episode for today. We're going we're gonna to put the kibosh on that. The last Climber is heading for home. That was quite a long little level, actually. Uh, there's plenty of ways that could go. Many of them probably better and more efficient than how I did it. But nobody takes efficiency into account when doing Lemmings saving. As long as you get it done, that is the important bit. Right? Right? Right.